Hi, welcome to episode 5. This is like the montage episode where we go and we collect all of the things on DK Island. We didn't really talk that much. It's kind of boring, so uh, we might cut parts out. We might fast forward, but it's uh, like an hour of footage almost, so have fun with it. Uh, and if you don't like this, um, okay, sorry. I'll give you a kiss kiss. Later, nerds. Oh shit, what time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Butterflies, baby! Welcome back to Donkey Kong, everybody. Yeah, hi. Alright, you gotta be the Lankster. Dude, I went and got some strawberry, uh, no, yeah, strawberry lemonade, no, raspberry, no, shit, I don't know, I'm colorblind. So strawberry, just... raspberry, strawberry, raspberry, blah, 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 raspberry, lemonade, ice cream the other day. Oh. With white chocolate chips. Oh, you must have already gotten this one. Really? I guess so. What? Okay, then. Hmm. All right. Okie dokie. Whatevs. Uh, yeah, it was so dang good, and I got white chocolate chips on it. Oh, I don't know if you like white chocolate chips, but if you don't, you're missing out, bro. Okay, so raspberry lemonade flavored ice cream. Yeah, it was either raspberry or strawberry. Yeah, and it wasn't too sugary, kind of like, um, shit, what's that stuff called? Um, mm, it's not ice cream, but it's like ice cream. Daiquiri? No. Gelato. <laughs> no, not gelato. Um, it's sorbet. Sor oh, yeah, sorbet. Oh, yeah. Sorbet is just like so sweet to me. Ugh. I can't remember the last time I ever had sorbet. Oh yeah. I, I remember like when my parents used to. My parents used to think I was allergic to wheat and dairy and oh, yeah. gluten for a while, and uh, so the, like they, I didn't have ice cream or milk or anything for a long time. Oh yeah. So like they. Whenever what we, do I do here? Uh, I think there's a switch you gotta hit with your uh, gun. Lanky? Uh, I think with the tiny. Uh... Whoa. Oh, yeah, there's a mushroom. What the hell? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, yep, that's a feather. Yeah, you gotta use tiny. Whoa. But yeah, whenever we'd go to Baskin Robbins, I'd, I'd always get the daiquiri flavored ice cream instead because it had no dairy. Eh, oh, it was man. never, it was could never be the real thing. A daiquiri? Yeah, not as good. Like a daiquiri is a type of drink. Uh, like a strawberry daiquiri. Ah, uh, okay. It's like an alcoholic beverage. Hmm. They taste very sweet and fruity. I gotta say, I, I am not a fan of alcoholic beverages in general. Whenever... I bet you would like a daiquiri. Really? Yes, I bet you would like a daiquiri. Whenever people are like, <laughs> my, my stepdad and uh, stepbrother were just... Yeah. Wait, This one's fast, dude. Suck my pixie dust, bitch. <laughs> Dang it! I, my brain like reacted so slow there. I was like, D -d -d press B. And my body's like, nah. Sparkle, 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 bitch. <laughs> um, my stepdad and stepbrother they recently made some honey. What is it? It's not moon. Moonshine's illegal, right? Yes and no. No. Okay. I don't think it was. Moon they they made this honey flavored alcoholic drink and i was like dude i love honey okay that must be good i gave it a sip <laughs> no thanks <laughs> really i can't think of any time in my life that i've ever i bet you would like a daiquiri really i'm telling you uh -huh. daiquiris are are pretty like it tastes like a slushy uh, it does like a slurpee yeah like a slurpee okay <sighs> this can be cracked open i'm like. I think you gotta hit that mushroom. How? With the uh, with your gun. I, that, that's kind of tedious, but also kind of cool. Yeah. There's gotta be there's something that opens that door. Maybe you just have to use the right con to shoot that mushroom thing. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll do some research. I mean, it's red, so maybe. Uh, uh, maybe. Hmm. You can you can look that up. Yeah, I'll do it right now. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's see. Then we got forest entrance mushroom. Mushroom. Yep. What color is now? Yellow. Yellow. Oh, great. So you just have to use all the cons. Yellow. Yeah. So yeah, you just be getting. All right. Yellow is color. Oh, what? There he is. What the hell? Another one? Are these? 
There's more than one? What? Oh, oh. That audience, or, or, or. That audience is so easily shocked. <laughs> yeah. Oh my lord! He just punched him! Oh but my goodness! Take this invisible crowd to the UFC and they'll just be like, oh, 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 I don't want videos. I want. Okay, how about this? DK Isle. Not do Isle. DK. There. <laughs> Fucking autocorrect. <laughs> DK Isle. Bananas. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, smooth. You're... Sick. Oh, wow. You actually made it. <laughs> that never happened. Oh, ow. Okay. Do, do, do. All right, well, whatever. I know oh, I have to do something on the X. With Chunkster. Yeah. <laughs> I've heard that if you land in Whoa. water from a high enough height... Oh, yeah, here's another chunky thing. Oh! <laughs> if you fall into water from a high enough height, it can feel like falling on concrete. Yeah. Yep. I've heard that as well. I never would have guessed that. Okay. Yeah! I know I'm not saying super funny stuff right now, but... It's yeah, me neither. I'm just, like, <laughs> I'm just like, we need to get through this. It's like, it's like, we're, at, it's like we're at Safeway. <laughs> Getting groceries. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Reading down a list. Okay, get the bananas, then the mayonnaise. Then the fortune cookies. Yay! How many fairies are there? Uh... Oh, I think there's 20 fairies in the entire game. Okay. Used... Thing. Whoa! Bye, tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just killed the tree. Yeah, apparently. Damn. Okay. Nice. <laughs> okay, I knew a rock blew up. Yeah. A mega banana. There it is. Ooh. Dang, this this is the preferred method of transport around this island. <laughs> yeah, dude. This is awesome. Oh my. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's a Jewish, that's a Jewish hat? hat, yeah. Yep, the little, like, circular hat. All right, okay. We, we got two boulders right here in a row. Yo! Sweetness. <laughs> and this one's for us. Ding, 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 I gotta say, playing through the hub world in this game, mm -hmm. it makes me respect what they did with uh, Kingdom Hearts 3. Yeah. Remember how playing, like, Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, the... The worlds feel kind of empty, and there's yeah. there's not many like civilian civilians standing around or doing anything. Mm -hmm. In Kingdom Hearts three, they added a lot more civilians into the level, so it actually feels like a real place. Oh, that's and not, cool. Not just a game hub world. I can imagine like if this game were made today, it'd be cool if like they had maybe some other monkeys or animals just sitting yeah. around, and you could chat with them. Who do I need? No, you lanky. need lanky. Yeah. Langster. I need the trombone, baby. Give me the trombone, baby. It's like Oh no. What? Oh great. Uh, oh, I yes. was. I knew that was gonna happen. Uh, I trombone. Yeah. Give me your trombone, baby. Do you believe in tromboners? I can feel something in my brain. What's that song called? I don't know. I really don't think you're strong enough, my old. <laughs> Do you believe in love when we believe? It's in a cranky special barrels. What? Ah. Uh -huh. There we go. I was thinking that'd be weird if they just gave you two golden bananas right next to each other like that. Yeah. That'd oh. be a little too easy. Oh, oh, oh. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, it's happening again. I gotta speed run this, you know, skip the animation. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Way to go, go dude. Nope. So recently, uh, so the girl that I'm still seeing right now, she, she's gonna be moving soon, which uh. kind of sucks, but eh, you know. Oh yeah, you said that. <laughs> but uh, so she and I, we had a we had a sleepover recently, which was a lot of fun. We she uh. I believe she held a Nintendo 64 controller for the first time ever. What? If I'm not mistaken. What? Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm remembering it incorrectly, but yeah, she held it and she was like, oh my god, this controller's so weird. And I, the way I explained it to her was, okay, you have to hold it by the dick. Just grab the middle part. That's how you play with it. There you go. <laughs> then I showed her Diddy Kong Racing. 
It's funny because yesterday when I was working on thumbnails for our videos, I uh, I was looking through pictures and I found this N64 controller that looked like a modern day controller, uh -huh. but it still had like the same buttons. It's just the control stick and the D-pad were switched. Oh. Like it is on an Xbox controller yeah. and the, the dick in the middle is gone. <laughs> you know, because they got rid of that. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so Crystal Caves. Crystal yeah, Caves. Stakes. Okay, I don't think I ever told you about this before. Uh-uh. What? So, remember how I had that job uh, aerating people's lawns? Yep. There was one or two times... Have you ever been in a backyard full of dog shit? <laughs> no. That happened to me twice. Oh my god. And I had to walk all over it. These people who I, I guess... They just did not take care of their backyard at all. Imbecile! It was just a gigantic minefield. Poop it was a minefield of dog shit it's instead of mine. Fest. Yes. Damn. I, I just had to be careful to not step on them. Oh my god. I was god. just like, okay. It was like that scene in Toy Story 2 when Woody's stepping around the Cheetos uh -huh. on the floor. Oh my <laughs> it was god. like that. <laughs> but of course, I was wearing my work boots, so it's like, yeah. eh, it's not a huge problem. <sighs> I had to Whoa. do that twice. Dang. So if you ever end up... I, I doubt you will, but... <laughs> yeah. If, if any of you ever work on lawns, be warned <laughs> of the shit minefields oh of doggy doo doo. <laughs> doggy doo doo poo poo! Mm hmm. I kinda want ice cream again. Shit. <laughs> you want some ice cream? Uh, yeah, it was so damn good. <laughs> I Dude, I recently, uh. No, it was last summer. Yeah. Last summer, I, uh, went to 7 Eleven and. There you go, right over there. 7 Eleven! And they had lemonade-flavored uh, Slurpees. Ooh. I was like, ooh, I'm in the mood for some lemonade. There's a 7-Eleven kind of nearby. Ooh. Mm. And it is particularly sunny out today. Mm. Um. Want to get diabetes? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, thank you. Oh. Uh, but yeah, so I, I had it, and halfway through it, I was like, oh, God, okay. This is way too sour for me. <laughs> Ugh. Oh god, Ugh, too sour. I ended up puking the next morning and not, oh, not going to work. Damn. Though the the funny thing is, uh, it's I tech I actually could have gone to work. Mm -hmm. It's just because I puked. When you puke before you go to work, naturally your first instinct is, huh? Well, I guess I shouldn't go to work if I just threw up. Mm -hmm. but, but then I. I guess it depends on why you throw up. <laughs> After a few hours passed, I was like, oh wait. I'm not sick. It's just from that yeah. stupid slurpee. I yeah, had. I was gonna say exactly like. And it. I was, was like, like, well, I already called in, so okay. <laughs> Free day for James. I feel like there's definitely something here. Ah, oh, there's a barrel. There's a bonus barrel up there. Probably for Diddy. Hmm. <laughs> oh, nice miss. Oh. Oh, there's a DK thing you had to shoot back there. Oh, really? Yep. You oh, just walked sweet. past it. Oh, it's for Lanky. Okay. Damn, that guy just took it. Yeah. <laughs> Kappa. Nice. Jinx. Uh. Good <laughs> lord, dude. You gotta... Nice. Have you ever heard that song, uh, The Ultimate Showdown? No. Oh, really? I don't think so. Old Godzilla was hopping around Tokyo City like a big playground when suddenly Batman burst from the shade. That rings a bell. And hit Godzilla with a back grenade. Godzilla got pissed and began to attack, but didn't expect to be marked by Shaq, who proceeded to open up a can yeah. of Shaq too. Yeah. When Evan Carter came out of the blue. Yeah, this rings a bell. I was thinking of doing my own cover of that song. Oh yeah? But with a harmonized track oh. along with it, so it's actually you know, something unique go for it, dog. Because it's not like that song. That song's more fun for the lyrics than... Oh! <laughs> oh. Okay. oh my. So I have some... I, I came up with more voice acting ideas for my channel. Yeah? By the way, I'm also at 400 subs. Nice. Yeah. Congrats, dude. Oh, did you see the new dub I made a few days ago? I saw you uploaded it. I don't think I watched it yet. Oh, uh, okay. I'll... Actually, that's fine. I'd rather see you react to it. Yeah. I, I, that's the best part. Instead of getting people to say, yeah, dude, that was funny, over text, it's like, no, I need to see their face. I need to see the laughter and joy I brought into their sad, depressing, pitiful lives. <laughs> I need to see the smiles on their lovely faces. 
Yay! <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. All right, cool. Oh my lord. Okay, let's see. Okay, what are we missing here? Okay, so here's this idea I have. Uh -huh. So I'm thinking of doing dubs of characters from video games in their cutscenes. Uh, do you remember Nitrous Oxide from Crash Team Racing? <clears throat> Not really, but okay. I was telling the dude at the demo, like, he, he's the villain of the game. Okay. He's an alien who talks like this. Mm. Hello, you puny earth folk. I see that you like to race. Well, I, Nitrous Oxide, am the galaxy's fastest racer. Get ready to race for the fate of your pitiful planet. Mm. Uh, I was thinking of, like, dub oh. dubbing my voice over. Yeah, see, there you go. Oh, so we're not even in yet. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Ooh, listen to that music. Yeah, dude, it's spooky. So yeah, I was thinking of doing a dub of the the cutscenes with nitrous oxide from that game. Hmm. And then uh I was thinking of maybe do you so you remember how instruction manuals for video games used to come with stories? Mm-hmm. Like at the beginning there was like a several paragraphs written to explain the story of the game before it get, went on to like Here's how you do this. Press this button to do this. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hey, cockblock. We will. See you later, alligator. Um, I was thinking of maybe narrating those. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, man. Because I, I recently played just through... Just for funsies. Yeah, just for fun. Some Get some narration practice in there. Uh, I recently uh, played through Diddy Kong Racing, and I was like, hmm, let me look up the... Because you can look up instruction manuals online. And you can read through them. So oh. I was thinking of maybe doing one for Diddy Kong Racing. Oh, okay. And maybe some other Nintendo 64 games. Cool, dude. <sighs> you know, I think that might be kind of fun. Yeah, that would be cool. Because I, I, think, I think people don't often think about those. So when people see that in a YouTube video, they might be like, Oh yeah, I remember those. Games don't do that anymore. Nice, cool. What don't they do? Sorry? Put stories in the manuals. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nowadays, they don't even, like, make instruction manuals anymore. No. Nah. They save paper. Yeah, exactly. That's... I, I wish more products would do that. Like, not just games. Like, a lot of things. Like, you buy a printer or something. Maybe you want the basic setup. But, like, okay, so Elgato, uh -huh. um, the company, does a fantastic job with their packaging. That is my favorite company when it comes to packaging. Um, they give you what you bought. So, if you bought a capture card, you get a capture card, you get, like, a little like singular piece of paper uh -huh. that says uh if you want to find out how to set this up go to this website and here's like the warranty information so maybe like two sheets of paper the box which is really nice and then your your object and that's it hmm. they don't give you a bunch of crap the box is always super nice there's like foam padding and all their crap seems like um yeah it's it's good huh. they do a fantastic job so you prefer that instead of a manual? Oh my god, yeah. I wish stuff would stop giving me, like, junk. Um, I feel bad, because, like, I just throw it away. You hey, know? You it's mean, like a you paper waste. <laughs> Elliot, Elliot put this paper thing in, in the garbage oh, yeah. earlier when I got here. It was my old tabs. Yeah, I, I looked at it, and I was like, how despicable. You or Jen threw a piece of paper in the garbage. That's gross. I took it, I took it, and... I think you just took it and put it back in. Yep. I was like, why'd you do that? Well, okay, you didn't even see me put it in. You were just throwing something away. You found the paper in there, and you're like, oh, how dare I find this in your trash? Yeah. You, like, go through my trash, take it out. Well, it was right on top. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was. <laughs> and, then, and I was like, why did you put the paper in the garbage? And Elliot was like, because I felt like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a fuck. No, I just tabs and stuff, so I, um... Suck my nuts. Yeah. My name is, my name is the Elliot. I don't speak for the trees. No, bitch. the uh, sorry. The reason I I'm pretty sure it has a wax coating on. Oh, 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 okay. <gasps> wow, gotta love how, how Donkey Kong just sits directly on top yeah, of the on lava. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Like it's a floor. Just use your instrument. That's your camera. Yeah. That's your orange. I'm just gonna do this. Okay. What the hell? Nice. I don't even care if I fall off. Just get it at least. <laughs> okay, nice. so now we only need one banana. That's all we're missing now. For uh, With uh, Chunky or Diddy? Diddy. Dude, this is a 37 minute episode right now. Yeah. 
but it's like we're getting it done. I feel like this would be the most boring thing to watch for someone, so <laughs> I think we'll just give them all this, or you can cut out I'll, crap. I, I might cut. I'll, I'll cut out the stuff that's not interesting. There's, yeah, probably a lot of that. <laughs> hey, so God. here, maybe you can show this part right in, in the beginning of the episode. All right, welcome to episode five. This is like the montage episode where we go and we collect all of the things on DK Island. We didn't really talk that much. It's kind of boring, so uh, we might cut parts out. We might fast forward, but it's uh, like an hour of footage almost, so have fun with it. Uh, and if you don't like this, um, okay, sorry. I'll give you a gift kiss. Yeah, later, Alright, gotta just save some berries. Yeah, I gotta keep this up for a while. Why is he getting up first? <laughs> it fucking feels like it. No! Oh, oh god, oh Jesus, ah! Oh, I just went down his esophagus. Oh god, I'm burning in his stomach acid. <coughs> oh, I guess some of them have <coughs> different timers. <sighs> that voice really hurts my throat. I always forget that. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> oh! No! I remember that one comic dub I did with uh, the two witches, no. Kotake and Kome. Yeah. That really friggin' hurt my throat after a while. Oh, really? Yeah. <coughs> oh, yeah. We let some fairies die. Hooray. Only a few died. That's a number I can live with. Yay. Well. Okay. We just. Oh. Okay. Woo. Wow. So we just. Now Wait, we you can go... totally just enter with Diddy then. Nope. No? No. Oh. Let's see. Oh lord. I was just gonna go to Snide's, but... Yeah, let's go see Snide. Okay. So how are we gonna do Snide, and then we'll yeah, catch then, the next episode? Yeah, we'll go to the next episode after Hot that. Hot damn. Oi vey, welcome to the 20 minutes of Snide time. There Are there any blueprints in the last level? I don't think so, right? Nope, uh, you, cause you need to collect all the blueprints oh, yeah. before Snide, because the each more, one gives you more time, right? Each one gives you another minute of time. So, what's the max time? Uh, I think there's 40 blueprints total. So, but what's the base starter? Like 20? So, probably an hour or something. Ah, uh, maybe. Something. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Uh, bye bye. All right. Let's see how long this takes. Seven more boot. Seven. Oh. Does he do all seven at once? Oh, so it's just Diddy's bananas. Oh, we what? have to go in with every con. Yeah. Yeah, oh. I knew that. Oh, okay. That's why I wanted to save this. Uh, okay. Do we have to watch the animation seven times? I think only once. I hope so. I hope so. God, I hope so. <laughs> the animation's cool, but God, I don't want to watch this 50 million times. Human hand? Yeah, like Beaver Bother? I hope not. Wait, huh? I think Snide chopped off some dude's hand for his uh, lab or whatever. <laughs> Here we go again. What, what does that do? Like everything else has a purpose, and then it's just like, yeah! If, if they ever. You know what that kind of reminds me of? You remember how in Breath of the Wild, whenever you complete a shrine, it shows you the cutscene of like, you truly must possess the spirit of a hero. Something, something, blah, 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 blah. It gives you the Chica Orb. Uh -huh. I forget what it's called then. May the goddess smile on you, blah, blah, blah. You have to go through that shit every time. Like, well, you can skip it, I think. <laughs> if this game were made today. So we're still gonna be missing one banana then. Uh, are we? Yeah, because they say Tiny has six, and you can only get any of all the fairies. Yeah, but, I mean, you can collect 200. Yeah. So, the 201st banana is the one you'll get once, uh, we go through Hideout Helm. Wait. Because I think there's some golden bananas in Hideout Helm. Oh, really? I think so, at least. Ah, I'll remember. <laughs> we'll see. Oh my oh, god. Oh my god. Yeah, it was like a 50 minute episode. Oh, Jesus. No, it's not. Not 42 minutes. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like three episodes in one. And that's our long episode. It's really like four and a half episodes of our normal rate. Uh, We're gonna have so many episodes. Get, like, episodes are gonna feel so short going back to normal games. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, why is Yay. this uh, rare? What do you have to say for yourselves? 
Jesus. Dude, could you imagine if we did this in every episode, though? Like, Fuck that. That's why I was like, we're going to save him. Okay, Final Kong. I will say, this game, like, I'm ready to be done. Mm -hmm. But I still like this game. Like, it's... It's still one of my favorite games of all time. I've been, I've enjoyed this Let's Play. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. I've enjoyed the road. This has been fun. Yep. Getting to relive some memories. Yeah, for sure. Some le uh, less pleasant <laughs> than uh, I remember, but you know yeah, what? Same. The but overall, the pleasantness and the, the pleasantries and the fun I had is about what I expected. The the pros outweigh the cons. Yeah, I think so. Most people like. Or not most, but a lot of people just hate this game. Yeah, people. A lot of people love hate relationship. I guess. There's there's this one guy. God, James, put his name on screen. He there's this guy who did a a retrospective of the entire Donkey Kong series, uh -huh. and he loves Donkey Kong Country one and two. Mm -hmm. And uh, when he says that when he first played Donkey Kong sixty four, mm -hmm. he was like, "Huh, this really doesn't feel like the previous games." Uh, whatever, I'll just stick with it. And he just could not bring himself to beat it because oh. the previous games were all about linear, yeah. left to right, fast platforming. Yeah. There was even a commercial where these guys were like, so it's just. <gasps> We've done it, boys! Yay! Bonus! Oh, snap. Let's try that out. Kremlin Kosh, Bonkers Barrel, Beaver. Okay, I think we had. Ha ha ha. So funny. You selected Yay. Beaver Father. Oh my god, what a riot. That is such a knee slapper. Uh, 15 of them, if I can do this on the first time, you have to buy me nothing. But you have to watch me eat a candy. And if you lose, I have to buy you uh, a new Bugatti Veyron. Is that a car? Uh, yeah. I, Bugatti, is, I think it's called Bugatti Veyron. I don't give a shit about cars. Anyways, what I was gonna say. Yeah, so. There was a commercial before DK64 came out. These two dudes are like, Mission Complete Kong, let's deal with K. Rule now, shall we? Whoa, it's not colored. Yeah. All right. So, let me just finish this before the episode ends. Sure. These guys are like, so Donkey Kong 64, it's just like Donkey Kong Country, right? Now in 3D? Yeah, dude, it's just like it. And the guy's like, no, it is not. It's a fucking monstrosity collectathon. He he explained this one part in Jungle Japes where you go in as uh you you go in this one cave as chunky. Mm -hmm. Oh okay, there's like a splat in there and his hair is blue. Okay, let me just run out of the cave super slowly. Let me turn into Lanky and come back, <laughs> kill him, get the blueprints. Ugh, god, this is so time consuming. And then you get to this door and you have to hit it it's two feather switches that you need to hit with Tiny. So you have to go all the way back, turn into Tiny, and then come back. And you've wasted so much time <laughs> just to do something as simple as that. And he, he explains other crap like that. That he doesn't like. Yeah, but yeah, he's... Yeah, this game does not... Uh, I like how tedious the collectathon is. I mean, I, I still kind of enjoy it, but... Uh, well, I guess no time for that. We gotta... Kick. Let's continue this episode. Just kidding. All right, bye. Hope you guys enjoyed this collectathon. Kind of boringness. Uh, later, Gator. Uh, bye.